Hey gorgeous, Lois here and welcome to my channel. In today's video, as you can see from the title below, we are going to do an unboxing of the products that I got from Silky Girl Cosmetics recently. And at the same time, I will also do a makeup tutorial or I'll try to do a full face makeup tutorial using only the products that I got from them. So if you want to know more about these products, just keep on watching. So this is the box. So this is the box that I got from them at Pasensya na ako medyo maingay kasi umaga ngayon. So alam niyo naman, walang kamatayan yung manok or yung rooster ng kapitbahay namin. Hindi ko rin maitindihan kung bakit 24-7 siyang tumitila o parang hindi siya natutulog talaga. At may mga marinig kayo mga, you know, tricycle and all. So pasensya na ako medyo maingay. Ay! Lagi na lang ganun. So ito yung mga products na nakuha ko from Silky Girl. Again, Silky Girl Cosmetics, thank you so much. Para dun sa mga hindi pa nakakaalam, Silky Girl Cosmetics is a Malaysian brand. So obviously, these are all from Malaysia. But just so you know, available din ito sa mga selected supermarkets like Robinsons, if I'm not mistaken. Kahalerto ng Everbilena and Caroline sa Robinsons, yung mga cosmetics nila doon. Tapos, available din to sa, I think, Ever, mga supermarkets, Ever Moss or Ever Supermarkets. Meron pa ba nun hanggang ngayon? And then, online, available din natin ito sa Shopee and sa Lazada. Just recently lang din. So, ayun. At yung mga products na nakuha ko sa kanila, actually, I wouldn't say it's really a full face makeup, pero grabe, sobrang dami nilang pinadala sa akin. So, let's get started. Thank you very much, Paul. Ito rin ilalagay ko sa aking face, yung Fresh Skin Love Collagen Face Mist. Just to prep and prime my face, that's it. Na ng primer. The first product is their Silky Girl Newly Improved Magic BB Cushion. This has SPF 50 PA++++. So, all their products are basically formulated for Asian skin. So, it has improved ruby cell puff. And what I have here is Shade 01 Natural Light. They also sent me two refills. This one in open ko kasi isang shade para mapakita ko sa inyo kung anong difference nung natural light and yung rose beige. So I also have another refill. Thank you so much. Packaging wise, okay naman siya. Andito lahat ng information, the ingredients, yung brand name, and then sa likod nakalagay yung mga claims nila. So it claims to brighten and even out the skin tone. And then it has antioxidant that protects skin from free radicals. And then it has mineral water that hydrates and moisturizes skin for fresh and youthful skin daw. And then all in one na nga ito. Moisturizes skin, conceals imperfections, smoothens skin, 12 hours oil control. Ito na intriga to. Long wearing with non-comedogenic ingredients. SPF 50, PA++. This is fragrance free and formulated for Asian skin. And just so you know, the products from Silky Girl are not tested on animals or in short, they are all cruelty-free. And as far as I know, these are also all paraben-free, which is good. That's how it looks like. It's just very simple, pero wag yung babagsa kasi pini ko mababasag agad ito. Kung ano yung nakalagay dun sa box, hindi nakalagay sa likod. So again, this contains 50 grams of product and I have here the 1 in 01 Natural Light. This is what you get. You have a mirror, which is very cute and handy. And then the puff. Of course, this is the puff, which is really soft. So I won't be using any brush or anything. And then here, it's sealed. So please remove protective film before use. Close the compact tightly after use. And then, again. Parang medyo dark, pero let's not judge. So, ito yon natural light. Kukunin ko naman yung refill para mapakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung itsura ng rose beige. Parang, lagay ko nga dito yung rose beige kung ano mas ang kakayang ng skin ko. Hindi ko alam kung anong bagay eh. Sa natural light. Then ako sa natural light. I-blend ko na itong dalawa sa yung product. So I'll just damp this puff right here. And then put a little lang muna. Okay. 
Grabe hindi ako OA, pero grabe yung pores ko na cover niya. Tingnan niyo to. May pores. Dito ni na-visible yung pores ko. Ay, amazing. Ang ganda. Pero tingnan natin kung taong long lasting to. Mayroon ako konting redness eh. Tapos, hindi siya talaga, hindi siya matte. May pagka sticky pa rin siya or dewy. Look at the difference. Ito super kinis na. Ito, kita niyo pa rin yung redness. Mukhang okay ito ah. Sana lang talaga hindi mag-oil up yung aking face. So, tatapusin ko lang to. Ito na yung face ko right after applying the BB cushion. Wala siyang funky smell. Actually, wala na ako maamoy to be honest. And hindi ko sasabihin ng full coverage siya kasi nagdagdag pa ako ng konti. I would say that this is just on the medium coverage part. But so far, it's good. It's actually not sticky at all. Hindi rin naman siya matte. So, sakto lang. Of course, we cannot survive without the concealers. Alam niya yan. Lalo sa may mga dark circles and redness or mga dark spots. We have to conceal it. So, I have here their quick fix care concealer with Fraxinus Excelsior Bark Extract. I'll just try to Google it and try to put it somewhere here in the screen. Kung ano yun. So, they have two shades. We have the one in Natural Light and then the other one is in the shade... Natural medium, sorry. So yeah. By the way, before I proceed to the next product, sa pasin ko lang dito no. Yung mga ingredients nung like nung mascara, lipsticks, and all. Ano sa mismo seal? So ganito yung cura niya gorgeous so. Anjan pero pati ng gal mo no. Hula na. So sa na lang naka print don sa mismo. Dito or nakadikit naka sticker na lang or naka stick na lang para at least katagra mo yung tanggali mo yung mismo seal. Ano pa rin yung mga ingredients? Makikita mo pa rin yung ibang information. So, yun lang naman. So, ganito yung tura niya. Meron siya parang brush here. And hindi ko alam kung paano ito. Tinutwist ata or something. Parang ganito. Ano ba ito? Pinupush ba ito? So, gorgeous. Ganito siya. Parang siya injection. Meron siya pinipindot dito. Para lang bas yung product. So, weirdo na lang ako talaga, no? Ang hirap niyang ilabas. So, check mo na natin yung natural medium. Nating natural medium. Oh my gosh, ang daming lumabas na product. And then, ito naman yung sa light. Ang hirap niyo! Ano ba? Ayan. Ito naman yung light. Sayang to, oh. Gamitin ko na nga rin. Lalagay ko na lang yung iba dito. Ang hirap eh. Sayang yung product. Hayaan mo na. Pagtsagaan na natin. Tapos ipapatong ko na lang yung light dito sa under eye area ko. Actually, this one is convenient. Kasi gaganyan mo na lang. Oh. Brush, brush ka na lang. Naraman siya Walang amoy. Walang amoy. Ayaw ko ba? Parang wala naman. So, kiniklaim na product na ito na it fixes the dark circles, dark spots, fine lines, and imperfections. Which naman talaga ginagawa ng concealer sa ating skin dapat. May mga concealers kasi na pag in-apply mo, mas madidefine yung lines mo. Sana ito hindi. So far, okay, ah. Okay. The next one is their Perfect Brow Liner and Powder. So, they have two shades. They have Dark Brown and then the other one is Natural Brown. So, dalawang magkabilang side siya. Dito, pag binuksan mo, ito yung product. Let's see kung gaano karami. This one contains 0.5 grams. And I know later on, magatanong kayo kung ano yung price ng bawat product. I'll just put it down below the description box. May little drop down there so you can just check it out later. So, ito yung natural brown. Ganyan. Dark brown. I'll use the dark brown. It's parang pang fill in. Ito yung dark, sorry, ito yung light brown. And this is 
the dark brown. So, ito daw ay long-lasting. Sana nga long-lasting ito. Now, if you have thick eyebrows or bushy eyebrows, might as well use a spoolie first. Brush nyo muna. Just follow the natural shape of your eyebrows. So, what I do, line ko lang yun dito, pataas. Yun yan. And then, I'll brush it pataas. Well, not really brush, but I line it out pataas. Ganyan. You can just fix it kung medyo, you know, lumampas ng konti. Okay lang yan. You can actually mimic ang natural hairs ng inyong eyebrows. So, it's up to you if you wanna use a powder, but I'll try the powder na rin. Kita niyo na actually yung difference ng right side ng brow ko or right brow ko compared sa left. So, okay na to. Oh, kapal ah. And then, just brush it. Kung di naman kayo satisfied or may lampas-lampas, just fix it with a concealer. Pero ako, I'll just leave it as it is. So, I'll just finish my other brow, then I'll get back to you for the next product. So, ayan mga gorgeous, done ako with my brows, my foundation. Of course, we have to put something on our eyes. So, for the eyeshadow, I got three of their mini eyeshadow palettes. So, I have the one in the shade 01, which is earthy. Sa likod, mga gorgeous, nakalagay yung instructions on how you can properly apply the eyeshadow on your eyes or eyelids. Ingredients and all. Open it. It looks like this. And it has a mini applicator, but I won't be using this one. So again, this is in 01 Earthy. And then the next one is 02. This is the one in the shade Blossom. And then the last one, which really caught my eye, is number 03 in the shade Sandy. I like the shades on this one, but baka pag halu halu ko na na siya sa aking eyes. So these three palettes consist of shimmers and matte. Pero hindi even yung number or count ng shimmer shades at yung matte, matte shades niya sa isang palette. So, gagamitin ko today is yung 02 Blossom and yung 03 Sandy. So, for the base, I'll be using this one. Para maset lang yung powder din dito. And I'll be using this peachy shade from the palette Sandy 03 and apply it all over my lids. I would have to be honest, it's not that pigmented. It's powdery. I don't know if you can see it, but powdery is so Yung shimmer shades niya medyo creamy. Sample lang to ha. I'll just just insert a clip or do a separate video ng no swatches for this. Pero hindi pigmented yung kanilang eyeshadow. Yung mga matte shades. So you have to do it over and over oh, para makuha mo yung color na gusto mo. Or maging intense yung color. And then for the crease, I'll be using this dark brown shade na may pagka-shimmer ng konti. Shimmer-shimmer konti lang. To contour my crease lang. Okay naman. Ito medyo ano agad. No, basta ka color. Add pa ako ng konting-konti lang dito sa corner. Then, nagaya ko konti ulit nung peachy color na inapply ko kanina. And then, yan, I'm blending everything in. So, para naman sa aking eyelids, magalagay ako ng shimmery shade from the palette Zero to Blossom. So, this one, this gold one right here. I'll just use my finger. This one is actually intense, oh. Super pigmented nito. Sana yung matte shades nila pigmented din. Sayang. Parang ganda pa naman ng... Hmm? Kita-kita nyo agad, oh. 
I like this color. So, blend lang natin after. Ayoko naman sobrang kapalan yung makeup ko kasi maga ngayon lalabas pa ako eh. I'll put the peachy shade and the dark brown shade sa lower lash line ko. Para lang ma-open up yung aking eyes. And then a bit of that gold shade dito sa inner corner. There you go. And the next one ay yung kailang 20 hour perfect stay eyeliner. So they have two shades. They have the blackest black and the dark brown. So it claims to be super long wearing and waterproof. How I wish I could really test if it's waterproof. So this is the darkest black. And then this one is in the shade brown. Madali tong gamitin. Sa mga beginners, mas okay to kasi mag-start kayo liquid eyeliner. Kaya ito pencil type siya. So, let's see. Ang eyes kung madaling mag, mag luha. So, may alam natin later kung talagang waterproof to or smudge proof or hindi. Itong left eye muna gagawin ko. Tapos, mamaya tapusin ko na lang to para mabilis makita nyo agad ko na resulta ng left eye ko. And then, of course, we wouldn't leave the house without putting mascara on our lashes. So, mga gorgeous, just so you know, just show, just so you know, I have um, natural hair extensions, pero halos pawala na rin siya. Not really pawala, pero, ano may nagalagas-lagas na rin siya. They sent me three waterproof mascaras. All of these are black, like black is black talaga. So this one that we have here is the Collagen Waterproof Mascara. This is the blue one. So this is the Big Eye Mascara. Ngayon ako nakakarinig ng mascara na may collagen. So ganti yung kanyang applicator. And then the other one is the Lash Prism Waterproof Mascara. This is for lengthening and volumizing. Volumizing. <laughs> Ayan. This is the applicator. So I think I'll use this one for my upper lashes. And then the next one is the eye opener. This is also waterproof, like what I said earlier. And this is how the applicator looks like. This is what I'll be using for my lower lashes. So now, gagamitin ko tong lash prism sa aking left eye. It's good to use waterproof products. Lalo na yung summer. Oh, wow! Mayroon na ako konting lampas dito. Pero it's okay. Ang pa. Nakailang patong na ako, oh. Wow. Just wow. So I'll use this eye opener on my lower lashes. We have to be careful. Oh, ini ito lago sa lobos, na ka frustrate. So ayan, yun yung aking eye makeup. I'll just finish the right eye and I'll get back to you for the next product. You know what, gorgeous? I decided why not? I'll use this big eye mascara on my right eye. Para makaalaman na kung talagang waterproof lahat or anong difference. Oh! Ito, hindi niya masyado na volumize, pero para may pagkalentenin din siya. So, we won't miss the contouring and highlighting part. So, they sent me two of their Silky Girl Photoshop Contour and Highlight Sticks. Kapakita ko na sa inyo, ito may seal. Nakalagay yung instructions, mga gorgeous, on how to properly apply the contour and highlight stick on your face. 
ingredients and all. Pero again, kapag tinanggal mo, mo wala na yun. So, I just wish, Silky Girl, sana lang naman, no? I just hope, in the future, magpalit kayo ng package or panagpalit kayo, mag-improve ng konti. Like, nakaprint na sana yung um, directions and ingredients. Kasi para kung di marunong mag-apply ng product yung bumili nito, tapos limot-limot, diba? Tulad ko. <laughs> Ayan. So, ito yung, ano ha, shade ng pang-contour nila. Natural light. And then, this is the highlighter na kasama nito. Parang illuminator. Maganda. Tapos, this one that I have here. This is natural medium. Which is darker than this one, obviously. This is the highlight that comes along with it. Para sa contour and highlight. So, dito kong mag-start. Ayan siya. And then dito. Sa panga. Para magkapanga tayo. Hindi pa naman ako sanay gumagamit ng contour stick. O ganyan lang. Contour tayo ng nose. Dito sa chin. Tapos sa highlight, dito tayo lagay sa taas. And then sa nose. Cupid's go. And I'll be using this microfiber sponge to blend everything in na uh, medyo madumi na. Kita niyo yung difference, no? Parang nagkaroon na ng coloring sides ng face ko. Actually, I prefer powder. Pero dahil wala naman tayong powder, I'll just leave it as is. If you wanna add more, that's fine. Know what? I also put highlights sa brow bone area ko. Ayan, it's brown. Apparently, wala akong blush na receive. I'll just use a different brand for the blush. I'll skip it out. Then, let's proceed with the powder and the lipstick na. So, ayan. Tapos na ako sa aking cheeks. Magadagdag lang ako ng konti pang highlight. Marabi talaga yung manok sa kapit ko. Okay? Gusto ko siyang ratuin. <laughs> Yan, we're almost done! Siyempre, hindi tayo pwedeng umalis sa hindi na sa set yung ating face with the powder. So, they have their Silky Girl No Sebum Mineral Powder that has natural minerals and ingredients. So, this is an oil control free powder. So, tingnan natin. Meron siyang puff. Ganyan yung itsura. This reminds me of the Innis Free No Sebum Powder din. Although, hindi ko lang alam kung pareho lang ha. And then, ito yung gagamitin ko. Ito ay aking blush brush. Pero actually, malinis sa ito eh. May mansya-mansya lang ng konti. And then, lagay tayo dito. Tapos natin. Parang hindi ko gusto amoy. Sabi fragrance-free, pero... Hmm. Hmm, hindi ko type yung amoy. Yung parang bago. Ang tapang. Ewan ko lang ha. Mula tayo konti sa ating under eye, sa ating T-zone. Dito sa ating nose. I'm sure, at sana makatulong to para hindi mag-oil up yung ating face agad. Translucent powder ito eh, parang translucent siya. Hmm. Alam nyo, ikokontor ko yung nose ko using yung brown na shade excess doon sa eyeshadow brush ko.
Mas okay. Sobrang dami niya yung lipsticks na pinadala sa akin. So, we have here the OMG Silky Girl Powder Matte Lipsticks. I have four shades actually. But, I don't think magagamit ko itong lahat. Siyempre. Papakita ko na lang sa inyo yung itsura. Pero, magagawa ko ng separate video for this watch. Eh. So, gan ganito siya. May push button siya sa dito. And then, you have to just pull it out. This is the color. Wow, ang ganda. This is in Blossom. Parang ito yung gusto kong gamitin na yun. I don't know. Ito medyo dark siya ng konti. Kung nang itsura niya. Tapos, yung isa may pagka pink, isa red. So, I'll do this different or separate swatch on that. And then I have here their Silky Girl Matte. Junkie, which they claim to be long-lasting, kiss-proof, or smudge-proof. So, I think they have eight shades. Kaya alam mo, isang shade dito na na-duplicate. So, na-duplicate sa akin yung Enigma, yung number 12. And today, by just looking at it, I decided to use the Blossom Powder Matte Lipstick. And then, I'm gonna top coat it with... Let's see... Um, I'm gonna top coat it with terracotta. So guys, ito na yung mocha sa aking lips. Powder matte lipstick. It's very easy to glide. Ayun siya oh. Ang ganda. Tsaka hindi mukhang drying lips ko. And then I'll be using this shade na swatch ko na terracotta. It has a doe foot applicator which is good. And let's give it a try if it's really good. Wow. Alam nyo, ang ganda. I swear. Ang hirap magarap ng lip product na hindi may emphasize yung crack ng inyong lips. This one is just so... Amazing. So, dahil pinagpatong yung lipstick ko, hindi ko alam kung it will appear to be kiss-proof. But this one, let me check. Wala siya masyadong transfer. And I like it. Wala talaga siya masyadong transfer. Yung side lang sa powder matte ang nag-transfer sa akin. Pero wala talaga halos. Wala talaga. Good job. By the way, before anything else, they also sent me their Pure Fresh All-in-One Gel Makeup Remover. So, I'll do a separate video on um, removing my makeup using this product only. Probably I'll just post it somewhere on my Facebook page or Instagram. So, this is the final look, mga gorgeous. But we have to do a time check. So, now is 12.11 p.m. So, babalikan ko kayo later. May pupunta na kami ni Mother. Um, babalikan ko kayo pag nakawin na ako ng house. And then, I'll try to probably just take a short video or photo kung nag-oil up na ako or hindi. In the next couple of hours. Hindi ako mag-blot. Hanggat kaya ko ding mag-blot. Okay? So, we would know if the BB cushion and the powder ay talaga nakakatulong para hindi mag-oil up yung ating face. I'll get back to you later, mga gorgeous. Hi, gorgeous! I'm back! So, kaka-uwi ko lang ng house. Kanina nag-time check tayo mga 12, 11, or 12 p.m. So, now it's already 6.01 in the evening. Six hours na tama ba? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, it's been six hours already at promise hindi ako nag-retouch or anything. In fact, I have my oil control film here right with me. Kasi diba kiniklaim nung BB cushion nila na 20 hours daw yung tatagal ito sa inyong face at hindi ganun ka-oily yung ating face at naglagay ako nung no sebum mineral powder earlier. <coughs> Excuse me. So, dumura tayo sa ano ha, hahawihin ko lang ito para makita nyo mismo. Ako talaga pinagpawisan na ako. I have to be honest, pinagpawisan ako pero hinihaan ko na siya matuyo. Matuyo. So, kung medyo marami tayo makakuha ang oil sa no ko, normal lang yon Ang concern ko is yung sa other sides ng T-zone. So, ito, hindi pa gamit to. Try natin yung sa nose. Actually, puro pawis na nante. Ayan. 
na yung konti dito. So, ito yung total oil na nakuha sa buong face ko for 6 hours. I think lang ha, for me, it's not bad. Kasi, na-expect ko na gamit pa ako ng more than one or two of these um, oil control film. Pero, mukhang okay naman. Ang hindi ko lang gusto, mga gorgeous, ay nag-clog ng konting aking pores. Ngayon yung itsura. Ayan lang. Pero sa, sa forehead, sa cheeks, sa chin ko, and other sides of my face, okay yung BB cushion. And I think nakatulong din itong no sebum uh, mineral powder nila. So itong dalawa, I highly recommend. Pero kung gusto nyo na hindi maging visible yung pores nyo, especially sa nose ko, ganon, Siguro, mas maganda kung ginamit ako ng primer. I think. So, try natin next time. Baka sa inyo mag-work yun. Kasi, iba-iba tayo ng skin types. I have oily to combination skin. And I have large pores. So, next time, I would use a primer before applying the BB cushion. Next! Next ay yung eyebrows. Pawis na pawis ako, ha? Ang kilay ko nandiyan pa rin. Mm-hmm. Wala. Okay. Check tayo sa eyebrows. Okay na okay to. Eyeshadow. Eyeshadow. It's still there. Okay yung eyeshadow. But, again, like what I've mentioned earlier, yung mga matte shades niya, hindi as pigmented as the other shades. Mas pigmented yung mga shimmery shades. So, sana, in the future, mag-iba yung formula ng kanilang eyeshadow palettes. Kasi, maganda talaga yung colors or yung color combination per palette. Eyeliner. Wala kang may reklamo. Gusto ko yung eyeliner. Mga ganitong klaseng eyeliner ang gusto ko yung retractable. So, okay sa akin yung eyeliner. So, sa mascara, ayan. Actually, mas pareho lang talaga. Actually, pareho lang sila. To be honest. Pero, mas okay itong kabila. Mas volumized yung aking eyelash dito. Dahil nga, ito yun yung lash prism lengthening and volumizing mascara nila. Well, the other one, this is just like your regular waterproof mascara. Pero, more on lengthening lang siya, hindi volumizing. And then, yung sa lower lash line ko, I've used this one, which is the eye opener mascara. At, to my surprise, na tumul na yung pawis ko dito in all, hindi po nag-smudge. So, good job. And then, for the contour, um, andun pa rin siya, konti na lang. Sa tingin ko, mas okay yung contour and highlight stick kung meron pang set. Yung sa highlight stick, um, okay lang, pero na-emphasize yung pores ko na ko, tinong tumatagal na. So, okay lang siya. Siguro, pwede siya kung hindi ko siya gagamitin ng uh, foundation, like, direct na sa skin. Feeling ko mas okay yon Parang natural looking lang. And then, yung concealer. I like the concealer. I think I have a new favorite. Kasi I've seen some reviews wherein hindi nila bet yung concealer. I don't know why. But, for me, it's really okay. At hindi na kick yung under eye area ko. So, good job sa concealer nila. And then, sa lipstick, if you'd remember, I've used the shade ng OMG Powder Matte na Mocha. This one. And then, I top-coated it with Terracotta. And as you can see, it's still there. I already ate cheeseburger. Mainan ko ng fries, may ketchup. I jumped iced tea. And I jumped Gatorade. So, talagang nispecify ko na pinahalat inyong pag iba. So, for the past 6 hours, I've been drinking a lot. And medyo oily yung hinahin ko. But, as you can see, the lip color, or yung colors from the two lip products that I got, Ay, nandito pa rin. So, I think they did a good job on most of the products. And actually, lahat gusto ko. Ang hindi ko lang talaga gusto ay yung kanilang contour and highlight stick. So, this one, Silky Girl, I'm really sorry. But I have to be honest that this one, I don't really like. Hindi ako na-impress um, doon sa contour and highlight. So, I would prefer to use next time a a powder highlighter niya lang. Sana magkaroon kayo. Eh, oh, meron ka available but sana meron. I haven't tried the blushes, Silky Girl. But, sana matry ko siya in the future. And then, the um, contour yun. Next time, I'll just use a different bronzer on top of the BB cushion to set everything in. But, overall, okay na okay sa akin yung product na ito. So, again, mga gorgeous, that's all for today. I'll just put all the information on the description box below. And then, lahat ng price. And then, I'll put their social media account so you can check them out. Be sure to check them out, mga gorgeous. And then, 
if you have any comments or any suggestions please do leave a comment below like of course share this with your friends and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already Maraming salamat sa pagstay hanggang sa dulo ng video na ito. I really, really appreciate mga gorgeous. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!